Now, when this first came out, I made some remarks about not being a fan of reasoning models. However, after using it a little bit more and giving it a bit of a chance, I've discovered that I think it might be a lot better than I actually thought it was. Now, if you don't know, I made this website very recently. I've been testing DeepSeek, etc. What I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to use the same prompt, but with Claude thinking. First of all, I create the project. I'm just going to use my own school, all of my prompts in one place. And then I have this SOP here. So first thing is to create a Next.js project with this specific number here. This should create the app. Now we're ready to use Klein. We'll go grab the prompt from Google Docs. And yeah, we'll, we'll see how this goes. So I've had to just change it over to the normal model quickly. The reason being is the output is too long and it's trying to just one shot the entire changes and it's just not working. Okay, so this is what it has come up with. Now this has some nice animations to it, very similar to Sonic 3.7. Some things aren't working like the Italian, but that's fine. I'd say this is marginally better than Sonic 3.7 without thinking, but the cost is definitely getting up there. In terms of whether this is game changing etc i wouldn't say so i would say it's slightly more expensive for a slightly better result and it seems to be more reliable overall i would say probably slightly worth it it's slightly slower slightly more expensive but slightly better 